This video is going to be all about how you can get a bachelor's degree in marketing in as little as six months. And in this particular example, I'm going to show you how to do this at a university called WGU or Western Governors University. Now, there are several different universities you can do this at, but just to simplify things, I'm going to use this university as an example. But you can follow the same model at several other universities, which I'll talk about at the end of the video. And the tactics I'm going to reveal in this video are insanely valuable. Previously, I only revealed it to my consulting clients. But I did make one video kind of talking about the whole process, and I got a ton of comments saying that I should make videos on the other degrees at WGU. So that's what we're going to be doing today. And not only am I going to break it down, make it insanely easy for you, but I also created a cheat sheet where I'm going to take you through step by step and show you exactly how you can do the same thing. So this is just making the whole process stupidly easy. This will probably save you 10 to 20 hours worth of research, as well as up to three years of school, you know, $50,000, et cetera. Bless you, boy. Bless you. So if you appreciate me giving you all this value completely free, go ahead, gently tap that like button, and let's jump into it. All right, so this is a four-step process, and you want to follow each of these steps one by one, right? So you don't want to jump to step number three or anything like that. Make sure, even if you think you know what you're doing, that you follow all these steps. Do not skip ahead in the video. You will not skip me! I will not be skipped! In the first step, you are going to go ahead and transfer in all of your existing credits to a school like WGU. Now you wanna choose a school like WGU because it is a competency-based university. And what that basically means is they allow you to graduate based off of your competency, not based off of how much time you've spent in the school. And WGU is also very nice about the credits they accept. So for instance, in some cases they may accept military experience, work experience, certificates and certifications, AP and IB classes that you might have taken during high school, as well as other college classes. And of course, they also accept the typical stuff like CLEP exams, etc. So you're going to want to make a list of all those different things. You're going to want to get your transcript together and make sure you send that into WGU. At that point, you are going to get a list of classes back that you still have to take. And then you're going to move on to step number two, which is probably the most important step. And that is you are going to go ahead and pre-game the classes that you can take with third party companies. Right, so I like to call this the test out phase. And the reasons that you're gonna be using third party companies instead of just enrolling in WGU right away is very simple. It's easier, cheaper, and faster. And the third party companies that I personally recommend are going to be study.com, sophia.org, and straighterline.com. And I like them in that order. Study.com is my favorite, sophia.org is my second favorite, and straighterline is third. So a Bachelor of Science or BS in marketing at WGU is about 41 classes total. And you can very comfortably, even if you have a family, a full-time job and you're super busy, test out of one class per week, especially at the beginning when you're taking those entry-level classes. Now, if you're not so busy, it's much easier to test out of them. And I've seen people do one per day, sometimes even multiple in a single day. And this is how you are going to be able to knock these classes out super quickly. So for instance, here is somebody who talked about this on Reddit. They said 20 years in communications and marketing, did the degree in four to five months, right? So there are some ridiculous numbers that you're going to hear online for these WGU classes. So this person was able to knock the degree out in four to five months. This next person talks about how they're really busy. So, you know, they have kids and stuff, so they're not able to accelerate like some folks, but they will likely be able to get done with the entire thing in about three terms. Now a term is six months. So three terms is about a year and a half. So even if you're really busy, in many cases, you can get these degrees done in two years or less. And the greatest thing is you don't have to quit your job. You don't have to move across the country or anything like that. You can do this all in your free time. And they both say that they highly recommend WGU. So if you want to make this process as stupidly easy as possible, definitely check out my cheat sheet down in the description as well as the pinned comment below. This is going to be a cheat sheet for the marketing degree. It's going to make this entire process just stupidly easy because once you test out of these classes, they are going to send you the remaining classes left. And the cheat sheet is essentially just going to tell you what those classes are. So you don't really even have to wait. 
Now, after you've tested out those classes and transferred them into WGU, you're gonna go ahead and move on to the third step, which is you're gonna go ahead and pre-study the remaining classes, right? So a lot of people skip this step, but I highly recommend not doing that. And the reason for that is because you want to finish WGU in the least amount of time possible. And with this degree, it's very realistic to finish it in one term, that's six months. And one term at WGU costs about $3,500. So you can finish an entire bachelor's degree in terms of the time you're enrolled for $3,500. That's not bad. And in many cases, people end up getting grants and funding. So a lot of the time they don't pay anything. And in many cases, people actually don't graduate with any debt at all. So my best recommendations for pre-studying these classes is really two different things. So the first one is going to be the WGU subreddit. And specifically, you want to find the marketing WGU subreddit. They're going to go over different strategies and tactics, etc., to study for these degrees and pass the tests as quickly as possible. The second thing I recommend is going to be Facebook groups for WGU as well. It's similar to the subreddit, but there's going to be other people there who also go over strategies and tactics. And it's also a pretty good place to network. Now there's lots of other different places online where you can get free information on these classes. Of course, you wanna check out their curriculum to see what they actually go over. YouTube is great, Google's great, Khan Academy is free as well. Udemy can be a really good place for certain classes. And of course, if you're a textbook type of person, you can just get a textbook online or even order a physical textbook, You know, do one that's a few years old and you can probably get it for like 20 or $30. Now, after you've pre-studied these classes and you feel really comfortable, go ahead and move on to step number four, which is you are finally going to enroll in WGU and knock these classes out as fast as you possibly can. Oh, thank you! That took what? How, many, how long did that take? And since you pre-studied them, you will very likely be able to knock out all of the remaining classes in one term. And if not one term, probably two terms max. So realistically, even if you're super busy, you have a family, et cetera, you can knock this one out in less than two years. And in some cases, people take it super seriously and they're able to knock it out in much less than that. Now for some of the harder classes like marketing strategy and analytics and marketing management, make sure you contact your professor because that can be a great resource. So here's a person, for instance, who said they were able to graduate in two semesters. And yeah, there's tons of testimonials of people who have done this on YouTube, Reddit, et cetera. So it's completely legit. It's a top 10% university. It's regionally accredited and it is respected in many different industries. Now we're gonna go ahead and jump into the cheat sheet and I'm gonna take you through step-by-step step exactly how you would do this process. All right, so here is the cheat sheet for the marketing degree. Um, you can see on the far left here, these are the class IDs um, in this column right here, um, you know, business administration, uh, marketing. Uh, these are the names of the classes at WGU. In this column right here, these are the units for each of the classes. In this column right here, you have the study.com classes that actually transfer in. So um, I made it as simple as possible. So basically like English 104 at study.com. Um, here's the, the number for the study.com class, which is uh, 0057. This transfers in for English Composition 1 at WGU. So like I said, I tried to make this in just extremely simple. I will also be updating this in the future. So if there are you know better classes at sophia.org or straighter line or, or there's more classes, um, I will keep that updated. And I also have a column for certificates as well. Now, typically speaking, the difficulty also gets higher the lower you go. So green tends to be relatively easy. Yellow is a little bit harder and then red tends to be a little harder as well. But that's just generally speaking. Also, uh, if you want to go to the WGU website, you can click right there. And if you want to really easily be able to find the study.com class, you can just click there. It'll take you right to the exact class. And if you wanna do this entire process I'm about to show you yourself, you can just go file, make a copy, and then you can edit it and uh, do all of this process for your specific situation. So let's go ahead and move on to step number one, which is you're going to go ahead and transfer in your existing classes. So in this particular example, I kept it really simple, but let's just say you took AP math during high school, and then you also took a communications and an art class when you were in community college. So you were able to transfer in those three classes. 
So you didn't have that many classes to transfer in, but that's fine. You're going to go ahead and move on to step number two after that, which is you're going to test out of all the classes that you can using third party companies. So as you can see here, <laughs> you can test out of a lot of classes. It's actually over half of them. And this is just going to save you a ton of time and money. So you're going to go ahead and test out of those classes. And by the way, uh, when you go to study.com, I do have a coupon code that they were nice enough to give me, which is Shane Hummus. You use that at checkout and you will save 30% on your first three months. And you'll also be helping the channel out. So definitely take advantage of that. But after you transfer in all of those classes, you're going to see that these are the ones that are remaining. So I'll just do a real quick count here. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So you only have 10 classes remaining that you actually have to take at WGU itself. So at this point, you would move on to step number three, which is to pre-study the remaining classes. So you'd go ahead and pre-study these. And when you felt like you were ready, you would move on to step number four, which is you would go ahead and enroll and you'd knock out those remaining classes as fast as possible. Now, realistically, um, this is one of those degrees you can, I'm not going to say easily, but you can definitely knock it out in one term. So at that point, after you knock those classes out, you get your degree, you're gonna move on to step number five, which is you're gonna go and brag to your friends and your family that you graduated <laughs> with a bachelor's degree in six months. And if you're nice, you'll move on to step number six, which is you will tell them how you were able to do it. You'll reveal your tricks and you will send them this video so they can do it as well. So congratulations, you followed those steps and now you have a bachelor's degree way faster than just about anybody else. You saved yourself a ton of time, effort, money, and most importantly, this is the thing that nobody talks about, opportunity cost, right? Because at the time when everybody else is going to school on average 5.1 years to get a bachelor's degree, you're getting one in like something between six months and two years. And so that's going to be an extra three to four years that you're actually making money while everybody else is accumulating debt. Now, one thing I do want to say is WGU is a phenomenal option for a lot of people out there, but there are some downsides to going to WGU. One of them, very obviously, is it's all remote. So if you hate going to remote school, this may not be the best option for you. But there are other pros and cons, and I talk about them in this video right here, which I highly recommend you check out.